Man wearing MAGA hat assaulted while walking downtown Tucson. I guess they have a news story. Yep. Story you'll only see on four. A man says he ended up in the hospital because he was expressing his political beliefs leading up to last week's election. Why does this bitch look like she's on Xanax? Because well, probably she is. Downtown while urging I have no strong feelings. Republican while Put wearing my uh, make Or is that just America a lot of plastic again, surgery? I think Sons both. Potter, yeah. <laughs> yeah, both. Jonathan oh, God. Whoa. Wait a minute. Is that the same woman? That's not the same woman. Was it a bunch it? of high school cheerleaders that got, that got hired in Tucson? All right, some, the guy who runs uh, News 4 in Tucson is banging Man, these, these chicks, dude. I, I tell you what, when I was a kid, I used to watch these news babes, and I'd be like, oh, man, they're so fucking hot. But as I've gotten older, they just look kind of creepy. Yeah, they look like some kind of demon race. Like, look at her weird Like, I don't even know what she's nose. going for here. Yeah, like, she looks like she's from a well, fantasy dude, story or something. Like, the, the red princess that casts the spell. Like, why are, Why is that you delivering her is? news? This is a lot of Botox. Yes, like, be a, a professional. Put on, like, a pantsuit or something or a nice dress. Do your hair reasonably. Take a chisel and take off the fucking eight layers of foundation so you don't look like some <laughs> know, right? thing that crawled out of a fucking horror novel. Well, Tom, you know, it's like... Uh, it's like, ah! Uh, like, how are the people watching this not immediately struck with like, whoa, uh, what the fuck is giving all me the news? Si all the six-year-old men watching this are like, she oh, does damn, real good oh, hell, Yeah, I'd like to bend her over right there up against one of them red poles. She'd blend in, too. Nobody could see that. Show her my red pole. She could report <laughs> how big my fucking <laughs> cock is. <laughs> All right. Political beliefs, but he says those beliefs were attacked right here on Saturday night. <laughs> and oh, is it painful? My my ankle was just hanging there. As Sparks was. Oh my ankle! Oh, it was, my it was swollen. Oh, was it painful? There. My, my oh, ankle my was God. just hanging this there. Dude. I support President Trump. He's so Trump wonderful. Trump is my favorite person ever. I have Walking downtown. In my house. <laughs> Yeah, a man attacked him from behind. I felt a very strong grasp on my hat. Oh, he was and pulling it my hair back. back. And grabbed a lot of now, hair. Now, let me tell you what. This is a grasp that I am familiar with. Trust me, <laughs> on a very personal basis. So, <laughs> at first, I thought something Ooh. good was going to happen, but then he just walloped me over the head, broke my ankle, <laughs> onto my ankle from behind, and so I. Uh, I, not knowing yet that my ankle was broken into four pieces, Damn. turned around to, to grab and take the hat back, and my hands latched onto the hat. They both fell to the ground. Well, I, the important thing is the hat is safe. Heard the words, uh, 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 Hitler and Nazi and Trump, and he was shouting, Hitler and Nazi and Trump. Yeah, Nazi Trump supporter. Nazi Trump Hitler. I'm Hitler, part Trump, of Antifa. Nazi. Fuck you. I love that. I love that people think that like. Like, I understand. There's a climate in this country. There's a lot of people that really hate Trump. But there are people that seem to be under the misapprehension that it's gotten to the point where we're okay with beating people that like Trump in public. You know what I mean? Like, in this, yeah. like where, where, when did this notion get in your head that it's okay to, like, grab somebody in public and throw them on the ground and break their ankle? Yeah, we saw a story about the, the kid got the, the drink thrown on him and shit. Yeah. Yeah. And with, and there's Occasionally been you hear a story about someone getting fucking attacked over these goddamn Trump hats. Oh, uh, well, the, 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 there's also been shit with the, it was like the Proud Boys. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. The, the conservative side to this shit where they go beat the shit out of Antifa and like, look, fuck these guys. Yeah, that uh, baked Alaska guy used to get like assaulted at a lot of his rallies. He was one of these MAGA guys. So he'd wear a MAGA hat and then some. Yeah, he'd go out there and like do interviews. It's like his little like white nationalist light thing that he does, you know, where you know he uses all the memes to say that he thinks white people are better, but doesn't come right out and say it. And he'd take that out on the street to these rallies and parades and shit. And sometimes people would dump shit on him or throw something at him or push. Which him. is exactly what he wanted, right? Of course. Look how fucking crazy and out of control these people are. Uh, Shouting things like that. Um, and then he came over top of me and he just over and over again. He hit me. People nearby ran over and pulled the attacker off Sparks and held him until police arrived. Tucson police say he was arrested for assault. I was making a statement that I personally believe that uh, Donald Trump, Trump is wonderful, uh, is a fantastic president of the United oh, States. Oh, he's beautiful. And I think uh, intolerance to those ideologies was. Uh, I love the close up of his shirt, dude. Did Paul, have you seen the fucking pic of, like, Trump Luther, dude? Trump Luther? Was the flame. Yeah, dude. 
Spark oh, yeah, says he Lex, feels things oh, yeah, would be yeah, different if he was carrying yeah, his tight Dude, Trump looks like, like a lot for, more like the evil CEO something character. Something tells me that's or, a liver spotty or, lumpy or I was head, a black though. Guy. Yeah. Oh, but um, you know what? It just which, adds to uh, the, the fucking whole evil CEO thing. Like, he's kind of ugly. He looks bad, but it's like he still has all the power. <laughs> I'm ugly. I'm fucking Melania. <laughs> I'm president. <laughs> I mean, he looked a lot better as Lex Luthor than he did. I mean, he did. If, if it's if true that, that picture is an accurate depiction of what that would look like. I guess I have to pull it up. Well, now. here's the thing. It's God, been why'd you fucking bring that up? Now I got to go fucking pull the damn picture. Well, have to, dude, because that was actually like the only time I've actually seen Trump. And I was like, Trump doesn't look like. Yeah, he kind of totally looks, horrible. He looked kind of respectable for a second. He did. Well, let me tell you why it's not possible. Trump has got hair plugs and shit. He's had hair removal and replacement surgery and shit, so his scalp looks like a fucking nightmare. Dude, look at that shit. Dude, Trump almost kind of looks like Putin a little bit, dude. You know what this is, dude? Let me tell you a, an old dude that gets to pull this off. An old dude that gets to pull, pull this off is an old dude that took care of his fucking head. When he started going bald, he shaved his head immediately, and he started cultivating this. He oiled his head. He kept it nice and moist up there so that it didn't get all crusty and <laughs> liver spotted and covered in fucking surgical scars like Trump says. Trump would look like a Frankenstein nightmare <laughs> with his head shaved. I shit you not, it would be like a weird, there'd be like a weird puckered area back here because what they do, like the type of hair replacement surgery that I think he's had, that people have speculated that he's had, mm -hmm. involves slicing into the back of your head and pulling the skin up so that the hair that normally grows out of the back, which normally old guys, if you look at Jesse Ventura, that's what, if you just let yourself go bald, that's what you look like. Right. You got plenty of nice long thick hair at the back and around the sides. Just not on top. So it takes, the, that the surgery takes all of those natural areas of growth and pulls them towards the center of the head. Ugh. Yeah, that's a nightmare. This Sh dude would look like a my fucking head. zombie in my head. if they shaved his head. And I guarantee you, he wouldn't be able to grow a beard like this either. There's a reason why we've never, ever, one time, not even during the rebellious 80s when it was popular to have one for business guys, never once saw a Trump with a beard. You know why? You got a weak ass beard. He, no, I think, it, I, I think it comes in patchy. Oh, shit, yep. dude. And I think that his whole life it has come in patchy, and he fears it. So what we don't, have you ever seen Trump with stubble? No. Mm, yeah. No. Think about it. Not really. Think about it. This is an idealized fantasy. A masturbatory fantasy from one of these fucking the Donald tards. That's where I got it. That, oh, I, I, I dude, it does not shock me. I guarantee you if they shaved this man's head and gave him a week and a half or two weeks or three weeks, whatever it would take to grow a beard of that length for, for him and gave him an unveiling, what they saw would horrify and shock them. <laughs> I'm beautiful. Strangely enough, I was able to find an article about this. Can self-styled alpha male Donald Trump not grow a beard? Not so alpha after all. Huh? See, I didn't even know this was a thing that other people noticed, but I have, he is baby face to the extreme. Never a, uh, never a five o'clock shadow, never stubble. So this guy says, you ready for this? Donald Trump probably can't grow a beard. That's right. Mr. Alpha Male McPissing Contest himself can't do the one thing that would truly make him a man, sprout hair from his face. Actually, the whole notion that facial hair in any way defines man... Oh, yeah, yeah. It was funnier before you ex tried to explain that. Uh, Deadspin first lays, lays out its case with an anecdotal example of Trump's failure to ever mention beards on Twitter which is probably true of most people, but since Trump basically vomits every thought he has on the Twitter, it's strong circumstantial evidence. Uh, they also point out Trump has an extreme aversion to Islam, which is pretty beard-heavy. <laughs> um, and while such anecdotes are entertaining, they aren't oh, in fact dude, hard look proof, it up which is why Deadspin that. does a deep dive into the photographic evidence to reveal oh. the whole sordid truth. Dude, a close-up of Trump's face of is Trump's kind of disturbing. Oh, well, it's a, look, if you dude, get a close-up of them, the, the lips especially. It, you can see here, this is actually way more useful than the fucking article it's wrapped around. This close-up picture here. Because oh, there's not a God. single So, dude, TJ, speck. can you pull this aside and we can zoom even further and f further scrutinize? Because there's some stuff we've got to see. Okay. Good. This is this is even better now that it's full screen, but you can even zoom further. Yeah, where's the stuff? It doesn't stumble? look like it's going to let me zoom anymore. Okay, well, whatever. That's good enough. Okay, so the top lip. That's where I want to start. Yeah. Okay. Top Maybe lip. Maybe a little bit of hair. There's some you can see that he might be able to grow a Yeah, you see it there? But it would be like a Fu Manchu stash. He's got kind of like the Asian mustache hair pattern up there. 
where you can you can see that the the, the area of the most dense growth is to the side of the lip. So he's probably got a very weak, wispy mustache that if allowed to grow would turn into like a Fu Manchu stash. Now down below, you can tell he's shaving the chin too because those look like razor bumps that he's got going on there. I know that look well. I had them pretty much every day of my life when I was a smooth face. And then the rest of it is oddly like you can see the pores where there's hair follicles down here yeah, on the you neck. Can say, yeah. But it look how patchy and sporadic it is. There's no pattern of five o'clock shadow because he doesn't have a solid mask of hair that ever grows across one area of his face. So what they would get would be a zombie Frankenstein looking fuck with a patchy puby fucking beard that looks like a teenager that just sprouted his first fucking pube. It's me, Trump, guys. <laughs> hey, it's me, MAGA. The, gold, the god emperor's beard what do you think <laughs> i wish they would get their fucking uh, wish on this dude i wish that these maga idiots would get to see trump with his head shaved oh did it be beautiful to see them like and his beard at fucking two months growth it would be absurd trump's beard <laughs> is resplendent it would trump's be a pet. patchy nonsense he would look like a you know homeless what, crazy you know mental patient they are? that had a lobotomy you know how stupid they are dude they'd be fucking p- putting patches in their beers yeah i got patchy beer too just like emperor yeah, trump dude. does all these fucking liberal cucks with their liberal fucking beards not patchy enough bro <laughs> keep it patchy like this bro right here it's kind of patchy a little patchy you know what maybe? i mean it's strong down in the neck beard area yeah, but as it goes up, oh, dude, we can do this all day. I love looking at facial hair because it's one of the only things I've got on people. I can grow a decent beard, you know. Yeah, Paul's like my one area of yeah. superiority. And to there others. are so many people that want it that can't have it. Now he looks better there than he does in the news story. So it looks like he might have sh- done an ill-advised cleanup. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't really look good. Because like there, that picture, he looks a little better. Man, publishers clearing house really wants me to do this. Do it, dude. Get in there. Seven million Complete a week for entry. life, dude. Or seven thousand. Sorry, that's still jobs, good. not mobs. Comma, vote not Republican, dude. Like jobs, not mobs. Vote Republican this Tuesday. I mean, whatever. He's got dumb political opinions, but I think we all agree nobody should have broken his ankle. And I think we all agree Trump would look absurd. Yeah, you've convinced me <laughs> with a beard. You've convinced me that Lex Luthor Trump is but a fantasy. Dude, what, Paul, yeah. what happens if one day Trump comes out and he looks just like Lex Luthor, dude? And if he, that happens, then the makeup artist that did it to him will be the yeah, fucking... She won an Academy Award. Yep. <laughs>